Hey guys, Blubber here, and today we're gonna get over how to make money really fast in Greenville. So, um, yeah, this this video is gonna go in depth on how to make money, how to do it fast. Now, first, first thing you're gonna do is select a job. It doesn't matter what job you can choose, whatever job you want. Uh, so let's just go like Fox Mountain Bank, for example. Second of all, stay away from supercars. Now that kind of sounds uh, counterintuitive with me having a four GT spawned in. But we're actually gonna switch it out for something, uh, uh, something kind of fun, but you know, not too backy. Honda Civic Si, and you're gonna see why you want a slower car in a moment here. So in the new in GB4, you actually make more money by going the speed limit. So like, it might kind of, I don't know, it, it's not, it's based off how fast you're going. So like, if you go too fast, you're not gonna make much money. If you're going this middle, you're going to make a good amount of money. So, generally, you want to stick around the 55 range. That's like the golden range when it comes to farming money in this game. Alright, so. I also want a job because you get a $650 paycheck, so that's pretty sweet. Okay. Okay, let's get exactly 55. I hate this car right now. Okay, there we go. Exactly 55, right? 55 is the most efficient speed for you to go when farming money. Because that's the speed limit on this avenue, right? So here, let's keep on driving until we get um, some money. So let's just keep on going here. And $600 or 0 0.6 miles. That's pretty good if you ask me. Here, let's go one more time. Then we can see how much money we get. We can just keep on heading down this road. Also, sorry if you heard my drink there. So yeah, this, I mean, like, the strategy is kind of more boring, I'm not going to lie, but it is the most effective way to make money, so here. And you can use any car for this, but I highly suggest the slower car, like the Civic Si right here. I could even use the EcoBoost right there if I really wanted to, but yeah. You rest off using a slower car for this. Okay, let's see if we're going to get paid anytime soon here. For my knowledge, if you run red lights, it does not take away from your paycheck, so you can just, I'm pretty sure you can just fly through these red lights. I would not worry about that. Alrighty, are we gonna get paid anytime soon? <laughs> it's like, feels bad, man. There we go, 0 0.93 miles. See, we're, like, we're not making bank, but we're getting, like, nearly $1,000 for driving, like, a mile. Well, like, typically, if you're, like, going super, here, you know what, let's, 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 like, go super fast here. Watch it give me more money and me just be like 100% wrong. That, that would be kind of embarrassing. Okay, we are going 138 miles per hour. Let's just keep on going until we get our next paycheck. I have not been to this area of the map in like a century. G. Okay, crap, it ends there. Okay, we can, we can pull a U-turn. Okay. We should get our paycheck within a minute or so. But yeah, here, let's just like floor it, go way over a little bit that the game wants you to go. I swear, if I get more money from this, I'm gonna like literally die. See, okay, look, not 1.75 miles, $491. So that's less than when we traveled 0 0.6 miles. And that is why you want to go 55 miles per hour, because you make a lot more money going the speed limit. And that's like the main strategy when it comes to farming money. Um, some other tips I would recommend is, um, you know, always select a job. Also, I believe you make money when you ride in your friend's car. I'm not 100% sure on that. I believe they added that actually. So, uh, if anyone knows that, can you confirm or deny that in comments, please? And yeah, as I said, I would highly recommend a slower car. Like the Civic Si, I feel like is a really good choice. You could also go with the RX-8, Cobalt, you know, whatever you want. But stay away from supercars slash sport cars. They will ruin it for you. Also, one more thing. Uh, I would recommend staying in drive. Because you're going to go to slower speed and drive. And yeah. Also, always use cruise control. And yeah, that's kind of... I mean, like, okay. What are some tips and tricks I can go over here? Uh, oh, yeah. You always want to stick to main roads. Because the main roads are just, like, the easiest to navigate on. And with the new revamp, like the kind of like loops around like halfway around the map, so that's pretty good too. Yeah, so just like stick on the main roads. Main roads will 
be a more direct and easier route to do. Always stay in lows. And I would, I highly do not recommend turning ABS or TCS off. Keep those on. And as I said previously, just make sure you have your speed limiter on and all that. Not speed, I forget, I forget the word for it. Excuse me for that. And yeah, that's kind of all I really have. Just like, if you, if you guys know any good cars for like this tactic in the, just let me know in the comments below and I can maybe pin your comment or stuff or something like that. Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I will be releasing more RP videos soon. It's just like, I ha I messed up my sleep schedule over the weekend and I need some more or less, what's the word I'm looking for? Shorter, shorter slash easier to do videos while I get through the school week. But don't worry, this weekend and later into the week, there will be much, many more RP servers and we'll also be hosting our 2k subscriber special live stream so i'm super excited for that and i'll see you guys next time bye guys